Hey guys, what's up? It's Mr. HD Gamer 101 here, back with another episode of Airport CEO. This is going to be episode 11, I believe. I could be wrong about that. I have no idea. So, today, well, okay, first off, it's been a really long time. Um, this is my, since I uploaded uh, an uh, Airport CEO video. Basically, the last time I uploaded was a little bit of the way into my first college um, quarter. So first time, you know, doing all the college stuff. So I just wanted to really give myself some time with that to make sure I was doing everything properly and to make sure I still had time to do YouTube and all kinds of other stuff. And now I have basically gotten it all down and ready to go here towards the end of the quarter. And I'm about to have a month break over the uh, entirety of December. So definitely expect a lot of videos out then. But anyway, let's get into the video. So um, last time we left off this airport, um, well, we had gotten basically this, um, we had split off the, the two different like uh, security areas, I guess. And I left off the last video by saying that we were going to get rid of this and go everything over here. Now, I was just reading through the comments and stuff and there's a few issues. So one, I don't have any seating over here. So that could definitely be an issue with people that are arriving over on this side and just sitting down at the seats over here and then having to walk all the way over when it's time for their flight and then miss their flight. So one of the first things we're going to do is add some seating over here and see if that fixes it. Also, I apparently uh, have screwed up the conveyor belt system over here. Um, I need to connect. Oh, yep, that would do it. That'd do it right there for sure. Um, uh, this is, these are speed. Underground speed conveyor belts. Oh yeah, and I guess I can't really do anything about it until I play it. Alright, anyway, let's go for three speed. And we'll just sit here and wait until that gets fixed, I guess. Um, and yeah, this is going to gonna definitely have some issues and stuff like that. Um, who knows when this is about, when this is going to be done. Um... Yeah, I have no idea. I guess we'll just have to try and remember to check back in on that eventually. Um, the game seems to be running better than it did before. So optimization is a whole lot better. So yay for that. Uh, nope and nope. Get out of here. All right. Let's see. Um, yeah, we need to... I don't really remember why all those flights... I'm going to have to refresh my brain on why those flights are all uh, a wee bit late. A wee bit late. All right. When is this going to get fixed? All right. So what else are we going to do this video? Let's go ahead and add a seating area over here. That sounds like a, a pretty good idea. I think I'll just add one in right over here. Seating. Um, and then talk about actually some of the changes that uh, that came in this newest um, update. So in our new update, we actually... Hold on. I'm just trying to think here. Yeah, let's go with that. So in our newest airport CEO update, we actually have a new way of, um, how do I say it? A new way of doing runway entrance, entrances, in the words, entrances. So I actually didn't load up this world for a long time because I thought it was just going to be straight broken and I would have to go into season two. But thankfully, this is actually all still working. The old, um... What are these even called? I don't even remember. Um, that every that whole system is working uh, decently well. I don't know why that guy went on to the. Why are they going on here and not up there? All right, so there's definitely some pathing issues with it, and I think that's actually why they introduced this, which is the one, runway entrance and exit. So now we basically have new ways of entering and exiting our runways. So we have basically two different angles and then a straight, a straight one, and then uh, of the two different like uh, asphalt and concrete, and then the runway entrance and exit, uh, which is grass. Um, so those, if we ever, actually I probably will, probably in this episode, pause the game, probably turn on the developer mode, so that way I don't completely break the game when I change it. Um, 
Yeah, but that's going to make actually this runway obsolete. So I don't know. We might have to do some interesting things to get this to work properly. Um, but anyway, that's new. But thankfully, our old system seems to still be working. It's still in a broken state, of course. But it, yeah, like, seriously, dude, you're going to turn around. Yeah, all right. So we definitely need to change the way we're doing this. This is broke. Broke for sure. Um, all right. Yep, definitely broke. Anyway, so we have large passenger seating over here. Uh, let's go ahead and pop the flooring around over this. I know there's not a whole lot of seating right here. Can I go with another row? I think I can. Don't know why I stopped right there. Yep, sure can. All right, then what we will do is floor these guys off just like we always have. Boom, boom. Just like this. Pop the blue mat right underneath. And donezo. Oh. Alright. So, let's see. Did our... Did this ever get... Nope. Still not done yet. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. And by cool, I mean not cool. Not at all. Well, that's interesting. This guy's... They've got some color now on them. That's cool. I'm a fan. I like it. I like it a lot. Seems like our airport is still running decently smooth decently um not perfect but all right um what is up with our freaking construction workers just being crazy slow at everything like yeah they're doing sidewalks but is it really that slow do i have all my contractors deployed this is a wow it takes a long time to open up the tab menu hello hello there we go all right uh operations is what i want wow this menu is still laggy though very very laggy all right do i have i have all of my contractors deployed 79 do i have a better contract this is a this is a good question offered contracts that was a three-star building filter all contractors yep i have the best building. <laughs> that sucks all right well all right then. Uh, no, 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 no. I'm gonna assume that that's all because of people, and or like uh, luggage. Oh, <gasps> yes, luggage. All right. This is still gonna take forever to go in properly. Underground speed conveyor belt. Done. <laughs> Easy as that. All right. So now that that will eventually get built, eventually, um, we can continue on. Oh boy. All right. So no check-in desks available for that. How many stands do we have? Because the number of stands we have, well, I don't think we're ever filling up the stands, are we? No, we're getting pretty close. We're getting pretty close. So yeah, I guess we do need um, uh, a desk for every single stand we have. Meaning that we sort of need two more of these guys, which we don't have space for right there. Doesn't mean I can't put one up here though. I could do that, probably. I don't know how the conveyor belt would work, but I could probably do that. Um, we're not gonna do it right this second, but that's not a bad idea. All right, so now that we, the sidewalk is almost complete. Almost complete. Uh, let's see, wow, this is just really bare on that side. All right, I'm just happy the game is running better, uh, a lot better now. What is this guy waiting for? All right, so we still have a major, major backup of airplanes. Um, holy cow. Yep, I think that's probably going to be something we're going to need to do ASAP, at least on this runway, is get the entrances and exits. Um, but this runway is really imp why? 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 Okay. Yep, that's definitely something we're going to want to do. Um, do you wish to delay the flight by one hour? No, I do not. Okay, so... This is so odd. Alright, so what do we need to do to get that to be working properly? So we need our entrances, entrances and exits. This is an exit. Entrance. Entrance. Um... See, 
so this would have to go down here sort of like right there but I need it to go right there okay the problem though is that th um, planes can no longer I guess they're still going across them in my game but um, planes can't really cross runways anymore at least that's according to what my brother was telling me so please correct me in the comments if I'm wrong about that um, if planes can still run across runways that would make this viable um, if not I need to delete this runway delete this extend this runway a little bit and then basically take this length of runway and pop it up a little bit so that way I can go on to both of them without any issues and I think that's just what we're gonna do anyway um, how much money do we have we have a lot of money alright so money's not an issue at all um, yeah let's go ahead and do that so let's pause the game nope and nope then we open up the F10 menu just because this is for debugging purposes really that's about it um, what we need to do let's go ahead and reset the aircraft paths right now and then we'll see if that fixes the planes that we currently have on the runway if it doesn't then we're gonna be kinda screwed and then we're gonna turn on um, I don't remember exactly where it is but it's like no build yeah simulate construction we'll we'll turn that off um, so that way stuff just builds instantly uh, yeah we'll go ahead and do that alright let's see if playing this that didn't really change anything alright so what we're gonna do is turn simulate everything simulate construction off and then what we're gonna do is bulldoze our runway hello oh I can't do that huh so I have to turn oh boy this is really gonna screw up our airport alright so we're gonna close the runway this is oh, I have this set as departure only interesting so 2625 I need to remember that 2625 alright sounds good and then I need to demolish runway I am sure I'd want to demolish this runway boom boom just so that way we no longer have that runway then what we're gonna do I guess we can leave all of that stuff there I need to extend this runway north I believe a little bit R upgrade so I believe it's north that I want to go north yep all right so I'm just gonna pop this north a little bit more uh, let's go for 3,000 feet oh, maybe not yeah that, 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 that'll be more than enough for what we need at the moment all right then we're going to get rid of this cannot remove active or occupied Is there something there I don't know about? Oh, is it because the path? I bet you it's because the path is there. I don't really know how to get rid of that, though. Uh, let's find out. Taxiway paths. It's an active taxiway path. Well, how am I going to get rid of it? Oh. And okay, so maybe now. If not, this is gonna make this all. Oh boy. Um. Can I despawn all my aircraft? <laughs> is that something I can do? Uh, ch 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 spawn passengers, spawn staff, spawn vehicle, spawn aircraft. All right then. Well, um, I suppose not. So I might be absolutely screwed. Oh, solid. Let's go ahead and remove that. Uh, I really cannot remove this. Is there a way to force demolish something? Oh wow! Look at this. Look at this madness. Active dice here. Alright, maybe I just let all the planes figure 
stuff out. The problem, I need to just like turn off the airport. Because... This is not going to be working right. Alright, so... Well, I guess I could get this runway working as a, as a one way, but then the entrance and exit would have to be down there. Whatever, we'll make it work. Delete. And then delete. Okay. And I still can't get rid of this because it's active. Whatever that means. This is arrivals only though, right? Yeah. So no planes are going to be able to leave. But. Let's go ahead and reset aircraft paths. Which I don't remember how to do, but I just did it a little while ago. Airport paths. Where are you at? I was looking at it two seconds ago. Reset aircraft paths. Okay. Thanks. Yeah, I know. You guys don't have runways. I'm gonna have to get over it. Are you joking me? But it's just that that's active? Alright, I guess I can deal with that. Alright. Are we still active? Thank God. Good. All right, then we can delete this altogether, uh, which means deleting these. Um, in turn, deleting these. I can't delete that one yet, obviously. Boom, boom. And then we'll get rid of that. Okay, now what we can do is build this so we have our runway entrance yes uh, so which way are planes landing they're landing this way okay so this would need to be the entrance then all right so this is an entrance meaning that I need Yep, planes to do this, exactly. Although I guess it doesn't really matter. Yep, just like that. Okay. And then I want the other one. Which I'm going to assume is this. Yep, on this side. Just like so. All right, perfect. Now what I can do, theoretically, is... So those are my entrance and my exits. So this would be my exit. Exit only. And then this would be my entrance. And entrance only. Okay, cool. So that makes this pretty easy. Let's go with both arrival and departure for now on that. We can change it later if we need to. Then we need to pop our other runway in here. And what we can do for that. Oh boy, this is not going to be pretty. But it should theoretically work. Let's go ahead and build our taxiways in like that. And then... Oh boy. Like that, I think. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Sure. For now, that'll work. That's an exit. So, yeah, that should be perfectly fine, actually. Alright. And then we need our paths, obviously. Oops. From there to there. And then from there to there. And then from there to right there. All right, cool. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of all the extra paths we don't need. Just so that way the aircraft aren't too confused. These might be active, they're not. Cool. 
All right, that's looking pretty good now, if I do say so myself. Let's go ahead and get rid of these. Okay, looking good. Now what we need is the other runway. Let's have a run other runway going the other way, yeah? Invalid position. I guess I can have the runways right up against each other now, huh? I don't see any problems with that. The only reason I'm putting it right here is because of... I was pointing to my monitor. This guy right here. The... Yeah. So... Anyway, I could put them right now on each other. But I, I kind of want to put it right where it was. And I still can't delete this point. Nope. All right, screw it. We'll do it for now. Let's just see if this even works. All right, right there. Cool. And then we need to upgrade it to Upgrade to asphalt, please. Thank you. We need to toggle this. Okay, right. All right. So, north, north. How long are you now? Um, let's just keep upgrading until you hit the other thing, I guess. How long does it need to be? Two six two. Oh geez. Um. Well, I might have screwed this one up pretty hard already. North, please. Two six five two. Oh boy. Upgrade north. A. Okay, we're good. I'll probably do one more even. Okay, but now what we need to do. Let's get our exit, no, entrance, entrance or exit? Exit on this side. Oh, I see where we're gonna have some issues now. Okay, well, we'll figure it out, I guess. Uh, Let's go with that, and then we'll go with the other one for the other side. Yeah, that's the same one. Okay. Boom. Wow, that actually lines up with what was there before. That's cool. All right, and then we do taxiway foundations. Does it? It does. That's actually really cool. All right, and then we're not going to do that middle one at all. And we're going to do that. Okay. And then we will hook these up. And then we will tell... All right, so the runway is going this way. So this is an entrance. And this is an exit. Exit only. Okay. So now, theoretically, when I turn this guy on... Should be working just fine. Probably gonna have to reset the aircraft pads, but let's see what happens. We're looking good. Looking good. For sure, we are looking good. All right, let's go ahead and reset those aircraft pads. Turn back on. Simulate construction. Boom. This guy is still just standing there. I don't know what you're waiting for. Um, but I, there we go. Yay. Okay. Bulldoze. Get rid of this. And then, uh, with this. Cannot demolish. All right, fine. We'll leave it. Leave it. But this seems to be working pretty well for the moment. Anyway, that's basically the new update, uh, from what I can tell, what one of the larger things in the update was. Uh, we also got uh, remote stands, so I can show this to you. 
in a little bit, but basically what they allow you to do is put, well, stands not on a terminal. Uh, it's pretty cool. I don't fully understand them yet. We'll figure it out eventually, though. Alright, so everything seems to be working fairly well-ish. So that's good. And they're able to get... Oh, nice. Okay. So I can land medium aircraft on this, too. So yeah, this is what I was afraid was going to happen, though. You have to wait for all the other aircraft to get down. But what I have room for now is a whole nother... another thing but let's just keep with what we've got and I guess we can figure it out or we could do the one runway is for departure and the other one is for arrival we could do that as well which one did I have it as well this is an entrance so this and then but the thing is that's the exit for that one so, never mind. I, I don't have the runway set up properly to do that. Because everything would still be going to right there. So, we'll just leave it be for now. We'll leave it be. Both of them are just fine. Alright. So, now, let's make sure that this built properly. Indeed it did. It got built correctly. Alright. So, now... Seating. Is the seating done? Seating is done, and there's actually people sitting. Not in, That doesn't look like everybody that could be sitting is sitting, though. So let's go ahead and add some more. Some more seating to this. Uh, let's go ahead... I don't remember exactly what my plan was for this. So let's just add some more seating and say, screw it. Uh, seating. After all, this is the main entrance. Uh, no. Let's go ahead and put a, a two gap in there. Yep. Let's do that. Not that. This and then this. Not a big fan of the rain sound. It sounds really horrible, actually. Not not a big fan. Anyway, there's more seating. Pop that in there. Light concrete floor going up here and down. All right, that looks good. That should be a decent amount of seating for the moment. We can always expand it if we need more. Uh, nope, nope, get out of here. Yeah, okay. So we were almost done loading that plane. Yeah, so I think it's just a speed thing. Once we, hopefully, this fixes that issue a little bit. At least a little bit. Wow, look at all the security personnel we have. Let's make sure that our uh, personnel are doing all right. Our staff. Employee job tasks. Shortage of janitors. Well, I can fix that. Janitors are cheap. And it's not like we're running out of money or anything like that. Staff, 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 staff. Hire staff. And janitors. Hire all you up real quick. Thank you. Wait for this menu to close because it takes forever. There we go. And hit no. All right. Look at that. This is looking, this is actually looking pretty good. Cannot land as gate A5 is still occupied. That's A6, dude. But somebody can't get there. confused send them away for now send them away a6 that's this guy pull you can't reach a job site all right we'll just keep going on that all right so the next thing we're going to need to do let me check out the way i built these conveyors real quick all right that's easy to tap into easy money to tap into all right, so what I'm going to go ahead and do is add two more check-in desks over here. Uh, why? Because our uh, flight plan is pretty full, meaning that it's very possible that all six of these are coming and going at like the same exact time, meaning that we actually don't have enough check-in desks to handle that. Um, so yeah, we're just going to go ahead and add two. 
Um, one and then two. Sure. We'll, we will go with that. Um, yep, yep, yep. All right, looking good. And then what is this mat floor? Is this like marble or something? Looks like marble. Yep, marble indeed. All right, cool. And then let's go ahead and add... Well, I guess I don't really know exactly where it is. Uh, baggage. Underground conveyor belt. No, I want the speed conveyor belts. So they're both going to be the same in the middle, right? And then on the ends... Yeah, and then what we're going to do is this. Oh, wow, look at that. I was right. All right. Like that. Perfect. And then what we're going to do is that. I'm afraid if I do that. Oh, no. All right. Looks pretty good to me. Uh, oh, I didn't put the right kind of flooring all the way around. All the way around here. Marble. Thank you. Alright, cool. And then we'll just add our little tiny cues in right here. Cue me up. Uh, right there. Yep. And then build. These are mini miniature cues. Wow, that was a lot of flights that need help. All right. Anyway, new check-in desks. I have to tie these to a baggage bay. Which baggage bay does what? <laughs> I don't remember. Okay. That is correct. I want that baggage bay. That baggage bay. And this baggage bay. All right. That should be all we need to do. Looking good. All right. So seating over here looks fine. Seating over here looks fine. We have a lot of people still walking over the, over in between though. So slightly worried about that. And we're still having a lot of issues. Specifically in the B gate. What's going on over here? Or B terminal. I don't know. I really am not sure what our issue is. Really, really not sure. Um... Let's see. Somebody in the comments, let me know what's going on. Like, why why am I having to... Why are all these planes running so late? Like, I don't really see a reason for it right now. We have the seating. Theoretically, nobody should be getting up here and walking over to the other place. Let's just make sure that that's happening. Or, not happening. Ah. Uh. And I can filter these, right? Yeah, I don't want any of those. Thanks. Alright. So, is anybody... Large groups of people getting up from this seating area and walking over... To the other side? I don't think so. There's a lot of people who just got up and walked outside, though. Maybe that's... Yeah, I don't... Okay, so those are people walking out of the terminal. That's okay. That I don't really care about. Um, yeah, it doesn't look like anybody large amounts of... Well, maybe right there. Yeah, I don't know. I really don't know. A lot of the A flights are getting screwed up, though. A lot of these guys. Seems to be the bigger issue. So what's going on with that? Well, this just, like... So 0% service round, boarding is not completed, baggage loading, oh, just finished, service round is being started, baggage unloading hasn't happened yet. Oh, just happened, okay. So what gate is this? This is A3, so A3 is late. Alright, so it's a mixture of 
boarding as well as service rounds. So just people are not getting to the places they need to be fast enough. That's reasonable. So why? Boarding still isn't sub. So boarding finally finished. Jeez. That took so long. I just think the game isn't being smart about who it's assigning jobs to. You know, like, I wish I had manual control over. Okay, in this, in this staff room, I only want the staff that's working on these aircraft to be in this staff room. I don't want this service agent or ramp agent to have to come over here to do service rounds. That's just stupid. Um, yeah, it, I mean, other than that, that looks like the only issues that we're really having. It's just stuff isn't happening fast enough. So, I mean, I guess what I can do, um, broke question mark. There we go. Let's just extend this to like 55 minutes in between flights, minimum flight separation, I guess. And then just not do as many flights per day. Money is not an issue. I don't think. Wow. 38th of the what I do Has it really cost me that much per hour to run this. What is our, our airline satisfaction is probably pretty low. Yeah, it's not super hot. Not super hot across the board. I think what we did is we just built too large of an airport too soon. When the game wasn't like built for it yet. Like if we rebuilt this airport now, I think everything would work a lot better than it is working. Passenger camp board. Resolved. Let's see, one is still occupied. So planes can't land. What's our issue here? That was the issue there. Yeah, gee, general aviation is still really screwing us over. I mean, I guess I could fix that too. Could fix general aviation. Just give them their own little runway up here and just be like, here you go. Here's general aviation. Let's do that. Let's get rid of GA for now over here. That would fix not all of our problems, but a decent number of them. Nope. Okay. So, yeah, let's do that. Let's go ahead and build ourselves another runway. Small runway. That's all they need. Uh, let's just build it right up here. Boom. And then get ourselves some runway entrances and exits. There and there. And then get ourselves some grass taxiway foundations. I only think they need to be three wide here. For GA. And then... Can do something like this. And then another three by three. No, that wouldn't work. I don't know. Uh, then just get a ton of... Aircraft stands, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, look at that. I delete that and then go here. Eight aircraft stands. Isn't that just perfect? Oh, right. So I can't quite do that yet. So this will be all of our GA. We'll get rid of all of this. That'll help the traffic. What are we waiting for up here? I don't see anything that we're waiting for up here. This aircraft? Yeah. Maybe I should get rid of this grid system too. That kind of... I don't know if it's really slowing stuff down. Running late at gate, B, at gate B4. So this guy's waiting for something, even though it could easily... See, what was it waiting for? I really have no idea. Our air traffic controllers are just sucking really hard, I think. I think that's what it is. Um, okay, so what we're going to do is turn this on. I do definitely don't want commercial flights. Only GA. Operational mode, both. I'm going to go ahead and open the runway. Uh, and then I guess we'll get everything else eventually. 
Uh, let's see. Yeah, those guys are going to be doing a lot of stuff. I thought I turned that off. I thought I turned off this. I don't want them. Okay. This is a lot of people. Looks like we still need more seating. So, more seating it is. Uh, seating, seating, seating. FPS has officially gone down a lot as well. Probably because we're building a lot of stuff. This game does not like when you build things. More seating. Can never go wrong with more seating. That's actually very false. I'm sure you could go wrong at some point. The more people we can hold, that sounds awful, uh, the better, I guess. The more money we're going to make. You know, we still haven't even touched shops yet. Shops are going to be crazy good for the our airport, I think. I don't know. Or they could be crazy bad. I, I don't know. All right. Here. Yep. All right. Light concrete floor. Up, over, down, and across. Just like that. And we will eventually have more seating over there. Eventually. Yeah, what is up with these bags? It's resolved. They all get resolved. Oh, you know what? It's because this is... Alright, so... Wasn't I going to fix... I can't really fix that one. I could if I turn off building simulation and build a little thing right there. I could get it to work then. Um, but this, this guy, yeah, this could probably use some help. Probably build a room back here and then do, make it overground so that way the tilt trays actually work properly. Seems like there's not a lot of people doing bag stuff for this. Why, why is that? What is happening? What is orange? I don't even know. Underground something. Oh, yep. There's There be bags going through the system. Well, there were a few seconds ago. The bags are now stuck. Alright, so I think things... I think bags are getting stuck now. On this. So, let's go ahead and fix that as well, I guess. Yep, which means we need to turn off building simulation again because that's going to really screw us up if we don't do that. And pause the game and build ourselves some more terminal back here. Thank you. We can keep the wall because nobody ever needs to come back here. Well, I guess we could put a door back here. Yeah, we'll put a door back here. Why not uh, bulldoze this and then put a door, a little tiny door back here. Wood door. Boop. All right. Looking good. Now what we need to do is make the rest of these conveyor belts. Well, just, just this little bit overground. So conveyor belt, overground, speed conveyor belts. All right, well, let's get rid of the underground speeds first, I guess. That's a, probably a solid idea. Underground speed. Um, hello. Am I not doing this right? It's because there's a bag there. No, I'm doing something wrong. Underground speed conveyor belt. These aren't speed conveyor belts. They're just standard. Oops. Underground conveyor belt. What the heck are these? What? Oh, what is orange? I have no idea what this is. Oh, well, something worked on that one. And it worked on that one too. All right, so.
Boom. Done. All right, cool. Oops. Done. All right, cool. Now, overground conveyor belts. Done? Question mark? Is that done? Did I seriously build the wrong kind of... I think I did. I think I built the... Did I really build underground? Did I really? Oh my god, I did. Alright. Fine, 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 fine. We will take two. Take two on this one. That, 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 this, and this. Oh, and that. All right, cool. Now, overground. There we go. Hey, look at that. It's done now. Why do bags just get stuck on tilt trays? I don't really understand that. But I mean it's working, question mark? Is it really working now though? Did that change anything or are tilt trays just broken? It's very possible tilt trays are just broke. Yeah, they just despawned. So, tilt trays are broken, I guess. Unless, uh, let's see. Tray, 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 tray. This, this, this. What do I have to do to edit this? Oh. Yeah, I mean, it's doing the right things. I don't understand. Somebody in the comments, let me know what's going on with the tilt trays, because uh, I don't understand. Which means I'm just going to leave this one be too, because I don't want to deal with it. Let's turn back on building simulation. Oh, you know what? I probably screwed up by doing that is the... this. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. I meant to build that legit. Um, okay. Well, I suppose what I can do is this and then... That and then that. Okay. All right, there's that. And then this is GA only. Eventually, we will open up all 16 of these. I think it's 16. Might be 15. I don't know. It's a lot. Whatever it is. And yes, I know it's very, very not efficient. But, uh, whatever. Okay. Um, and then this is open, and then these are open. Okay, cool. So, now what I can do... is not allowed GA on these guys anymore. And then get rid of the GA stands. Oh, right. I can't really do that. Huh? Demolish. Oh, I have to. All right. I guess I can turn on them off, right? All right, whatever. Hopefully the GA aircraft can still take off. No. Wonderful. Dismiss aircraft. <laughs> Can I do that? No. Alright. Well, this is going to be a problem. Um, 
I guess I'm going to toggle that on to GA real quick. And just pay really close attention to when they leave so that way I can disable their stand. Alright, you guys can leave now. Like, seriously. No? Nobody's, nobody's taking it? Seriously. Come on. Let's go. What's wrong with your plane, dude? Runway entry not found at departing. What are you talking about? There's an entry right here, dude. Alright, I bugged the game. Alright, well. Solid. Um, well, that's not... I broke it. I broke the game, guys. <laughs> Officially broke. I can't click on anything else either. <laughs> this this is going to fix it. Let's see if this fixes it. Now, what the heck is going on? <laughs> oh, my entire game just crashed. Okay, nothing probably saved. I am so hyped about that. Let's go. Well... Um, everything we just did in this episode has been completely voided. None of it happened because the game crashed and there's no autosaves in this game. Ugh. I love it. So much. And that means I don't like it, by the way. Well, um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Next episode will be me rebuilding everything we just did. Or, let me know in the comments down below, do you want to just see Season 2? We have enough updates in the game now where it would make sense to kind of just start a new airport um and this one would i could upload the game save to uh the workshop uh which is what i actually did in episode four so there's an early version of this map but i can upload this that way you guys can play on it and build on it and fix all the problems it has or we could start season two which would be probably what my choice would be um start a new airport now that we've learned a whole lot more about this game hopefully we can make it so that way there's not as many issues. But yeah, let me know what you guys want to see down in the comments down below. I'll make sure, make sure you comment fast so that way I will um, actually, you know, make the next episode. And I'm hoping that this will go out uh, tomorrow. It's either today or tomorrow, which would be um, Thanksgiving or the day before. So yeah, anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, like, leave a like on it if you liked it, dislike if you disliked it, and make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any more airport CEO videos, especially if you want to start seeing either me rebuilding everything we did in this episode, which would be a really boring episode, or you want to see season two. Let me know in the comments down below, but anyway, I'm going to get out of here, and this has been Mr. AC Gamer 101 I'll see you next time. Peace out. Oh, um.